Beaujolais is hands down one of my favorite regions in the entire world for wine. Now a lot of people sort of confuse or overlook Beaujolais because when they think of Beaujolais, they think of Beaujolais Nouveau. Well, not all Beaujolais is created equal, and here's an example of a Cru Beaujolais, which means it comes from one of the 10 Crus, or very esteemed villages in Beaujolais, and these comprise the sort of highest classification of Beaujolais wine. So this is sort of a whole other ball game than what you might think about when you think of Beaujolais. The grape here is called Gamay, and what I really love about this example is that it has a lot more concentration and heft to it than a lot of other uh, wines made of Gamay and a lot of other examples of Beaujolais that you find. Now this wine has this sort of um, exotic sensibility. I get a lot of Chinese five spice powder, a lot of blackberry fruit and dark plum fruit. Um, Cru Beaujolais is also uh, much more substantial. It's a lot less thin than what you might see in uh, an example of Nouveau and it also has much longer aging potential. These are wines that are really starting to get a ton of press and a ton of hype, especially within the sommelier community. So this is just such a fantastic find, and it's made by a winery called Domaine de Colette. I'm Etty from the Plonk Wine Club. Cheers.